The Budweiser's back. Week three of the feeding schedule, and I want to alert you to a couple of changes in week three. Amp it um, will now be part of the program, anywhere from one to 2.5 milligrams per, and I'd start out with one, and then maybe the next week 2.5. And you're also going to use Hard and Quick, which a foliar feed. This requires five milliliters per gallon. And all you really need is a quart bottle, and so I would use one milliliter, very tiny amount. You'll spray twice a week from now uh, until flower. And when you do that, spray from the bottom up. Um, that benefits the plants. That's where the leaves can absorb the most. So um, we will continue on the every other day with um, um, Mikos. Um, and uh, veganic special sauce and recharge that will continue the same. Remember to pH down those items. At the end of the week, you're going to um, start with a screen of green. So you'll set that table up and create the screen of green. And um, you will also be super cropping once again. Between week two and three, right in there, some place you need to judge. When you've got at least eight branches, you're going to take off the bottom two, right up to the stem, right next to the stem, and you're going to leave four branches for your main branching, and you're going to take the top branches off right there. So you're going to have four main branches. It's the first stage of pruning for your super cropping, after which you will be tying down the highest branches to allow the other branches to come up. Auxins are light and gravity sensitive. They will push the top plant up and that will force the growth into the highest limb. So you want to bring those down, allow the other um, branches to come up. And that's it.